Well, hello everybody. Welcome to Buttermilk Travels. I want to go over one thing that's been expressed in the news as of right now is March the 10th is the cost of fuel and things about travel. You may have booked cruises and you may be getting on cruises uh, and paying a fuel surcharge. And let's explain that. When, if you're a first time cruiser, you may have never heard of the fuel surcharge. But at the bottom, down there in the fine print and everything, it says uh, if fuel surcharge may apply. And they will charge it to your account and make you pay it. There's no ifs, ands, and buts about it. How much it's gonna be, I don't know. I don't think it'll be over $100. Uh, shouldn't be. I think $40, $50 extra per person, maybe. Uh, could be $80 per person. Could be $100 per person, I don't know. I've never experienced. But as us getting ready to start traveling, because this is start of spring break, uh, I usually say the first or second week of March is officially start of spring break. This will run over into April, then after April, uh, then May, graduation, May, June, then vacation seasons really goes into full swing. So if you experience uh, fuel surcharge on your vacation, uh, feel free to drop by Buttermilk Travels here let me know uh, how much you've been paying. Uh, it's the first time I've posted back to this page. Um, we've kind of had <clears throat> a little bit of a revamp uh, about some things and stuff. So, very interested in everybody's travel. Uh, so, stick around. Let's see what happens next at Buttermilk Travels. But I want to hear about this fuel surcharge, uh, if anybody's experienced it. Everybody have a great day.